<laughs> that face. Hello fellow gamers, this is Tracy Mancer, and I'm going to be reviewing the Derpy Squids mod for Minecraft 1.6.4. And this is a pretty huge mod, so this is probably going to be a pretty lengthy mod review. Um, expect 20, 25 minutes. I'm going to make it as short as I can as I go through everything, but this is just a huge mod, and the mod creator went all out on this, because it's got everything, literally, it has all this crazy stuff, it's amazing, so I'll just go ahead and start. Right, so these are just some random um, kind of assorted items that I have here that are just, they just kind of come from the mobs and things, and you need them for other things. So, the bunch of yummy ink sacks. You craft this by getting nine ink sacks in the crafting table, and you get one bunch of yummy ink sacks. So that takes a while to get. A golden inky sack of doom. This one is just a bunch of yummy ink sacks surrounded by um, eight gold ingots, and you get a golden inky sack of doom. And then the derpinator. This stuff is crazy. I'll show you what it does in a minute. And um, it's a bucket with ink sacks around it and that's how you do that. Raw squid meat, this doesn't have a crafting recipe because it's basically um, dropped by squids. Uh, cooked squid meat, this is just raw squid meat being cooked and you get cooked, cooked squid meat and you can eat it. Uh, squid wing, I don't really know what that's from so don't ask. Uh, raw calamari, this is made by just putting raw squid meat all around in a like this, I don't know, and you get 18 of these so it's a lot. And then nice crispy calamari, you get these by smelting a raw calamari. And then there's a squid phone. And there's actually a lot of these, as you can see down here in TMI. Or, not enough items, sorry. Um, but basically, they, they just kind of play a noise. Watch. This is the, um, just the squid tune, and it's it plays music from the spot where you activated it, so if I walk away it'll get quieter. It should. Yeah, see? And if I walk back closer, it's louder again. So that's how that works. So we can throw that away. Now, an object that was on the forums, but isn't actually in the game right now, is the Squid Wolf Summoner. And you'll see what a Squid Wolf is when I go in and show you all the different mobs. But this is how you would craft it if it was in the game, but it's not right now. So, yeah. Now, the Derpinator. How this stuff works, you may just think it's, um, stupid. Um, it gives you nausea, resistance, and blindness, but really it makes you pretty much invincible while you have it. And see, I have a squid on my head, and, um, everything's all messed up, and all this stuff. But... It makes you invincible while the effects are lasting, but it gives you these side effects as well, so... It's like, um... It's like steroids, but the af the side effects happen right there. And then you're perfectly fine. So, yeah, that's, that's kind of how that works. Next, a few blocks that you'll need to have. So, there's the golden block of squidiness. Um, this is made by putting golden icky sacks of doom like this and you get a golden block of squidiness and that's what you need to get to the squid dimension or whatever the heck it's called, I don't really know the block of squidiness, uh, this is made by putting a bunch of yummy ink sacks like that and you get the block of squidiness, this is also needed to go to the squid dimension the boss squid statue piece, this doesn't have a crafting recipe and it can be found in the squid dimension and when I go there in a while I'll show you how it works, now the diamond encrusted squid squid aside, sorry, can't pronounce things. Um, it looks just like diamond when you place it down, but when you smelt it, you will get a diamond. So, yeah, that's pretty cool. And then the, um, the not quite so gold block, when you break it, a golden squid will pop up and it makes little derpy noises. Listen. There we go. So, um, yeah, when you break it, this'll be there, and there's kind of a glitch where it just flies. It'll come back down to the ground, but that's just a glitch with the mod right now, so you can just kill it, and they will drop one gold ingot. I'll get into the rest of, of the mod mobs later, and when you break this, it'll, um, 
Yeah, it's like a squid pig type thing. And if I go into game mode zero, this thing gets really angry. It basically circles me and is really, really fast. So you do not want to be surrounded by a bunch of those things because they are really aggressive. All right, next we will get into all the mobs. Um, these are some pretty crazy mobs. So I'll just go ahead and get in these right here. All right, so first the explosive squid. Now this is a squid that explodes and does damage when you hit it, I believe. Yeah, when you hit it, it explodes. So it's like a creeper when you hit it. And I believe it will kill you if you don't have any armor and you're standing close enough. So be careful of that. The um, flying squid. Yeah, pretty self-explanatory. It's a flying squid. It just kind of goes off. If you hit it, it'll go in the direction that you hit it. And, um, yeah, if you have a friend, you could play, like, soccer with it or something. I don't know. This may be a good mod for a soccer map. People, think about it. Now, the squid zombie. This is basically a zombie squid thingy. I don't really know. It's like a... It looks like he's... Like he has a really, really bad cold or something. When you kill it, it will drop the um, it will drop the raw calamari. So that's good. Um, let's see. Next, the ghost kermit. Is that what it is? Yeah, ghost kermit. That's weird. So this thing looks really, really weird. I honestly don't know what to say about this. And when you kill it, it uh, drops lily pads. So that's good. Now, the mild explosive squid, it's basically just like the explosive squid, except it doesn't have as strong as an explosion. It still dies, but, yeah. Next, the squid man. This is like a half squid, half human thingy. I don't know. This this guy got stuck somewhere on the evolutionary chain or something. I, I'm not sure. But, I feel pretty bad for him, and he has a... um. A squid sword, which when I get into weapons, you will see. But until then, we'll just kill him. So when he dies, he will drop um, raw squid meat. I uh, don't really know how much, but yeah. Next, the extra derpy squid. Just listen. Oh. Yeah, see, there he made the noise. When, when, um, when you walk into him, he will... Um, just kind of attach himself onto your head. He will suffocate and die like a normal squid, and you can just attack him with your sword or whatever you have in your hand. So next, the baby squid. It's basically just a baby squid. It makes the exact same noise as the derpy squid, but it's just a little one. That's apparently impossible to hit. Is it like in the ground? What? Well, it died anyways, and when you kill it, you will get ink sacks. Alright, other stuff. Um, Squid Army Recruit. This guy, um, he actually looks like Skydus Minecraft, and he has the zombie with the cold face and apparently can walk through the ground. Alright. And let's see. When you kill him, he will drop raw squid meat. So, there's that. The Talkative Squid. You can't get me. I'm over yep. here. And you're over there. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It speaks like Sky does Minecraft squids in his videos. Um, the mod maker said they sat down and recorded a whole bunch of audio here. for this mod, so I can't wait to see the rest of it. But, um, Stop. it's like the derpy Stop. squid. Yeah, so, that's pretty weird. Next, the golden squid. You guys saw this one earlier when I broke... Br broke the um fishy golden block or whatever the heck it was called but when you kill it it'll drop a piece of gold or two or three apparently so next the um the squid pig you guys already saw this one when i broke that fishy iron block so yeah there's that okay so last we have the items now there's a lot of items in this well not well i mean weapons gosh all right so the derpy axe, um, you basically craft all this stuff, the derpy axe, derpy pickaxe, derpy shovel, derpy sword, and I thought there was a, nope, that's, I thought there was a derpy hoe, but there's not. 
All right, so you basically craft these like you would any other. Um, it's the same basic crafting recipe. There's the block, you, but you use the block of squidinesses or whatever. So a stick and a block of squidiness, and that'll give you a sword. For the pickaxe, it's like this. So it's the basic same crafting recipes. Now, they all have an enchantment, derp, and um, all the normal tools have derp 1. The derpy sword has derp 2. So when you hit something with this, um, it basically, the derp effect will spawn a squid where you hit that mob. And it's the derpy squids, so don't let them touch you because they'll get on your head. I don't see a real point to them getting on your head though because they don't do damage or anything. So next, the armor. It's a uh, derpy squid chest plate, derpy squid helm, boots, and leggings. And these are crafted in the same way that you would craft armor but with a bunch of yummy ink sacks. There's nothing special about them other than the squidiness X. I guess I'll put on the chest plate so you can see the texture. I've, I haven't looked at the texture before. Alright, so... Oh! Well, that gave me huge arms. Okay. That's kind of a cool texture. So, there's nothing too special about it. Now, the Derpy Squid Gun. This is a weird thing. It's a um, piece of iron and then three golden ink sacks of... Golden inky sacks of doom. And then, to fire it, you just right-click. What the heck? What was that? You right-click, and it'll spawn a squid at your location. And then you can just kind of kill them if you can hopefully none of them will get on my head but yeah that's how it works and these guys just fly all on their own because there's a glitch in the mod or something I don't really know now these three items at the bottom the source is cheesy sword Betty the bow axe and ultra butter cannon um, I guess I'll just show you this one because these don't really have anything special but they are dropped and held by um, certain mobs in the squid dimension and I'll show you those once I go there so the the ultra butter cannon uh, basically you just right click and hold it'll kinda reel back and then you shoot it and it's kinda of like a little it's like a gas fireball except it um, it's gold or butter in this case die Come on, why can't I hit you? Stop moving. I'm bad at this. And of course, he doesn't move that time. You know what? Forget this. That's pretty much all of that stuff. These are drops, I believe. Um, you can probably figure out who's they're from by the look of it. So, now I will show you how to get into the squid dimension. Basically, you build a portal like you would with um, netherrack. And then to get in it, your flint and steel is this um, this block of squidiness. You place it down, and boom, there you go. Now you can go into the squid dimension, so I'll be right back when we get there. Alright, so here I am in the squid dimension. I just spawned in. I kind of spawned in under the ground that I didn't break. That's weird, I broke it. And then... I don't know, but uh, I spawned in, and there's just kind of a flying squid over there, and um, yeah, it's time to get started. So, let's go ahead and do this. Um, squid for the win. So, yeah, there are several different boss thingies um, here and all over the place. This is one of them. I didn't want to do this one first, but I guess I can. So, basically, at the top here... And I'm lagging. Alright, so at the top here, there's just kind of some little um, blocks that you'll see. And basically what these do is when you right-click them, they will actually spawn a little boss mob. So I'm going to get myself some of these because I know some of these boss mobs can be pretty um, intense. Go into game mode zero here. And we're ready to go. I got an awesome OP diamond sword, and let's begin. So this is the weed line boss, and its ability is don't really know. It doesn't really say, but um, it's dead, and it will drop weed line's ancient key. And all the bosses in this will drop an ancient key, and it's a there's apparently nothing here to put it in. 
but if I find it I'll show you what it is. So next we'll go ahead and do this one. This is a Decepti Squid Boss. I don't really know who this is. Not entirely sure. And I killed it and they dropped fish. And oh it's bonker. Or bonkers. Alright. So next is uh the bananas. Ooh, that was a lot of lag. Squid monkey boss. Oh, blue monkey mucks or something. And you can hear it's playing music from one of the discs and I killed him. That was easy. And I got blue monkey banana. Nice music. So, um, with each of these keys, you can, um, open up another level to something. They're pretty cool. So, I'll go ahead and go into game mode 1 here, and we can fly down to this thing. Oh. How many of these are there? Just one? Yeah. Alright, so, uh, let's go ahead and get started with this. I don't really know... Let's see, I've got three keys. Which one do you want? So basically in this giant temple-y thing... Oop. Oh. Well, um, that's how that works. And... Crap. There is a ton of mobs. Um... Oh, I'm still in creative mode. That's why they're not attacking me. Alright, so... Um, basically, you get the keys, and then you can do that, and that's kind of how it works. I'm afraid if I turn it to peaceful mode... Wait, oh. There we go. All the mobs are gone, and we can begin. So, this is the first level of our, um, or of this dungeon that we'll be adventuring through. And you see this block? That's actually a sponge. I just changed the texture in my custom texture pack. So I'll go ahead and put it back on default so you can see what it would be if normal. So here we go, sponges. And this is just like the blocks that were up at the top. I right click. I right click. UK, right click the top one. And it's Squid Solus Boss. Ability Hunger Attributes Cheese. Alright. So does it give me the... Oh, it gives me the hunger effect. That's cool. And... Um, when you kill them, they'll drop things, so we can get rid of those keys. So let's see what I get. Solus cheese? Ooh, you can eat it. Oh my god, it gives you poison! What the heck? That's stupid cheese. Golden apple. Alright, so the, um, the boss mob will drop a key, and basically with that key, you right-click it on this little part, and boom, there you go. Next area, so... What do we have here? Cactuses. Hmm. And parkour. Ooh, I like parkour. What's this? And it's Squiddle 40. Ability wither. Ooh, gives you the wither effect. Attributes cactus. Stupid cactus. Ooh. Alright. Bodil 40's ancient key. So with this, I can go to the next stage. And that's just kind of how it works. There'll be, um, there's a lot of bosses, and I believe they're all from, they're all people from Team Crafted, or people that Team Crafted know, and I hear more zombies and stupid things. That shouldn't be happening. Oh, here it is. Right click. And Squid Sorcerer, no! Attributes random magic. Yeah. I have a really strong sword if you want to see. So yeah, there's the effects. Alright. So, um, Seto's Ancient Key. And drop books. So with this, you can... Oh! No! Stupid zombie. So, let's go down here. Ah, oh, god dang it. Why do you have to ruin everything, Creeper? Die. Just die. I don't even care anymore. This place is fancy. I like it. What's this? Oh! It's Munching Squid Tato! Oh my gosh, he gives you slowness. And frogginess. Oh, it's the, um, Ghost Kermits from earlier. Don't give me slowness, you fool. Oh, he's dead. How long do I have slowness for? Nope. No longer. Get rid of all this useless stuff. And I got Brotato's Ancient Key. So, with this, we can continue. 
What's next? PvP. I like PvP. Who's this? And it's Esquiddy! Ability, strength, attributes, battle. Oh my gosh, how can I not hurt you sometimes? That's weird. Take damage and die. There we go. And he dropped an iron sword and the S. Sunday's ancient key. So we'll go ahead and continue here. Ooh, it's a forest. This is nice. Oh, it's that Betty arrow or bow axe or whatever. And it's Fluffy the Squid. Ability, Baka. Attributes, very hairy. I wonder what Baka does. Nothing. Oh, gosh, I'm gonna die, maybe. I need to eat my golden apple. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes. You're doomed. There we go. And I got a diamond axe and Fluffy's ancient key. So, we'll go ahead and continue. Oh, no. Ugh. Looks like it's going to be dark down here, so I'm going to get night vision for eight minutes. This is just so you guys can see, because what? Because I use a program for rendering that makes everything tar dark. And we'll turn off rain because that's just annoying. Ah. There we go. Alright, so... Uh, uh, oh! It's... Squiddy Huskyips. Huskyips or whatever. Oh my gosh, he explodes! Die! Stop exploding! Stop it! Stop! You're not funny! Stop! There we go. Oh, I got a lot of clay. And where's his key? I swear, if you didn't drop a key... I'm going to be angry. Key here? Are you serious? Did he not drop a key? What? Mod maker, there's some glitches. That's dumb. Well, even though he didn't drop the key, that's okay because we can get it here. There it is. So, now we've got Husky's ancient key and we can continue. Stupid sand. There we go. Oh, it's clay! That's why it wasn't falling. There we go. Huh, I don't like that water being there. Where can I block it? Right here. Good, that worked. Alright. Ooh, this room is laggy. Dang. That's not good. Wonder whose room this is. Alright, squid locks. And ability undead army. Oh my gosh, it's the cold zombies. And attributes music. Oh, okay. Stupid locks, come on, just die. So many freaking zombies, oh my gosh. Um, did I kill him? Oh, there's the key. Yeah, I killed him. Oh my gosh, look at all this EXP. Dang, where's the ooh lag? Where's the, there it is. So let's get rid of all this useless stuff. And continue. Ice. I like ice. Ah! You ruin everything! Don't ruin this. Okay. It's Bayesian Squidding. Squ Squidian. I cannot pronounce things. Winning the ability, winning the Hunger Games. Attributes hitting you. Oh my gosh, he has a diamond sword. Golden apple. Can't kill me. I'm better than you. Die. Oh my gosh, how much health do you have? Stop it. Stop, stop. Okay, good. 
and he dropped a diamond sword, and ooh, this is colorful. I like this one. There's that. Oh, this is cool. Hmm. It's true Squid Universe. Oh my gosh, he spawns pigs. Squid pigs, stop. These things are evil. Okay, you're dead. Oh, you can see the eyes of the squid through his helmet. That's weird. Oh my god, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it. Come on, just die. Good, finally. Whoa, did it suddenly just get dark in here? Oh my gosh, he dropped endstone. That's awesome. Pretty useless, but if you like decorating, that's awesome. Ooh, flowers, grass, stuff, pink wool. Wait, just pink wool? Nothing special? Oh, <laughs> it's broken. Oh, no. Whose room could this be? Let's see, who have I not fought? So, Trumu and then Sky. There's nothing. What? Sun, Fluffy, Husky, Deadlocks, Bayesian, Trumu, Sky. Deadlocks, Bayesian, Trumu. Yeah, there's nothing. Ugh. This was probably a really good one, too. Oh, look. It's all stupid. Let's just spawn this in. Oh well, I'm sorry whose ever room this was, but the mod maker clearly forgot that it was important that you be included. So. I guess this is the end. This room looks great. I have a pretty good guess onto who this is, and I'm kind of scared. Here we go. Oh, he has a giant thing. Oh my gosh, he makes noises! Squid does Minecraft. Ability unknown. Seriously, why butter. Here? Attributes butter. Ow, Come on. Ow, ow, this lag is killing me. These noises. Ah. Let's just eat two for Seriously, pleasure. Man, I'm gonna hit you because you're stupid. Man, you so die. Oh my god, what the crap? What are you? Feel the wrath of my sword. Die, 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 die. Come on. Yes! Eat it! Eat it! Eat it! Oh god, I'm gonna die from poison. Hmm. Well, this place looks different now. Alright, that's okay. So, uh, squid phone just chilling. I can't believe you freaking killed me. You're. Are you serious? Dude, this is the only thing that's left of me now, is this freaking disc. Look at you! Are you proud of yourself? I was just chilling underground! I wasn't bothering anyone! You jerk! Okay. Well, thanks for that. Um, when he dies, you can see he will drop the butter cannon, which you can fire. Er... Okay, for whatever reason I can't fire it. Maybe... There. Maybe you have to... Yeah, when you're in survival, you have to use, um... Gold ingots as ammo. So, I will be back when I find the last boss. Okay, so I found this boss's arena. This is the last boss. Um, so, I was actually planning on doing the, on showing this boss first, but I couldn't find this one before. And it spawned next to another one of these things. Because they spawn everywhere. You ruin everything! Leave. Good. So, real quick here, just gonna get rid of all those mobs, and we can begin the final battle. 
So basically, this thing is. Oh my god, did it another creeper? Did you seriously just spawn? You're freaking serious. Get the heck off. I don't want you. Stupid thingy. Let's see. I'm gonna be really mad if this. If it doesn't spawn this thing. Alright, so I believe how it works is um, you put a block of squidiness on the top. I'm pretty sure about this. I'm not 100% sure, but I'm pretty sure. So we'll go into game mode zero here and uh, hope we don't die. First, gotta eat this. There we go. Crap! <laughs> Uh, maybe one of these. Oh, there we go. Uh, forget that right now. All right, so oh, yeah. Now I'm just angry. Oh my god. Ah, but it's okay. Go. Oh god. Oh, holy crap! You're big. And my golden. Ah. Come on. Oh my god. Holy crap. Oh god. Oh. Okay guys, so I just got back here and apparently the boss disappeared. So now I have to go and create another new one. <laughs> that face. That's a great face. Derpalus Squid Overlord. Well, why can't I hit you? Smack the legs? Smack the butt? Do you smack him in the butt? Okay, now you're not glitched. Where'd you go? There you are. You stupid thing die. Why can I not hit you? Oh! Oh, there we go. There we go. Yeah, how do you like me now? Go faster. Why does he keep glitching all over the place. This is like the wither. I hate the wither. Die. 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 Almost down to half health. Where are you? Oh my gosh, are you regenerating? Where'd he go? What the heck? You're all the way over here? Fucking regenerating What? I'm gonna hit you with my bow, and my bow is pretty good. Oh, I like to think it's pretty good, and that doesn't really seem to hurt you. I'll hit you with my sword. Come on. Come on. My sword doesn't have knockback. Knockback. You shouldn't go flying. Okay. Die, 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 die. Come on, come on. Don't you dare regenerate. I swear, if you regenerate right now, I'm gonna kill you even more. Good! Ooh, what was that? Oh, that's so cool! Did you see that? Oh my god, that's awesome! The ultimate derp squid blade. What? Can be used to turn some mobs into squids. Hey, Enderman! <gasps> oh my god, it's a squid! And now I'm going to kill you with this sword. How much damage does it do? Not much. Alright, well, thanks for watching, guys. I believe that is pretty much everything for this mod. As I told you in the beginning of the video, it's a pretty big mod. The mod maker went all out. This is by far the coolest mod I've seen probably ever. Because there's just so much you can do. And it doesn't crash. There are some bugs like Husky not dropping that key and um, whoever's room that was at the very bottom before the final boss. I can only guess it'd be Donables, maybe. I don't know. But anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Um, like if you liked it. Subscribe if you want to see more videos. I'll, I don't do daily videos. I try and get them out whenever I can. So, yeah. Again, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.